Hello everybody and welcome back to Manador 72G and today we got a Commander Legends Draft Booster Box open here. I'm um, not drafting it, just kind of opening it. Uh, bought this off Amazon for like $100. Um, it was on sale, you know, I had like 15 extra Amazon credit or whatever from being a Prime member or whatever. So I, you know, I just figured I'd buy it, you know, why not? It's one of my favorite sets, like pretty much uh, since I've started playing Magic, that this one in like Modern Horizons, maybe Modern Horizons two, um, probably my two favorite sets. I mean, they're pretty good. They're very, very good uh, in my opinion. Oh, and uh, Mystery Booster Box, another one that's really good. But that is a four hundred dollars set, and I don't feel like buying that um, just for like a Mana Crypt or not even a Mana Crypt. So uh, yeah, let's get this thing opened. I hope this isn't like repacked because Amazon is kind of sketchy to buy stuff from. But it doesn't seem like it. I hope not. I hope it's not repacked. If it's repacked, I'm going to cry. Um, looks pretty crispy, though. Like, it looks definitely looks unopened. Um, is it? Nope, it's definitely this way. I have not opened a booster box in a very long time. I've been over a booster box since. Hmm. Let's see, probably since. They look fine. Anyways, I uh, probably haven't opened a booster box since. Let me think. Probably Modern Horizons 2. Um. That was like a year ago, a yearish. So yeah, it's, it's been a pretty long time. I, I mean, usually I just buy singles, but um, yeah. Recently just bought, started buying, or recently just bought this one because it's a good set in my opinion. Um, a lot of good reprints. So let's get started. All right, I'm gonna go through the first couple packs real slow. This is Crow of the Dark. Tidings. Oh. Nice. Skyraker Giant. Nice. I, I did buy two bu two boxes of this when it first came out, and I, I did not very... I didn't get very good pulls, but I, I actually enjoyed opening it because of all the... I think there's uncommon a lot of uncommon um, commanders in this, so... Kite Steel Corsair. Gift of Paradise. I did pull a Vampiric Tutor out of one. And I think I pulled a Mana Drain as well, but I don't know. Um, impulsive Pulsar and Visser series in here too. One of the best Sakai lets in Magic. Souls Fire. Captain's Call. Arhaven Elf. Bitter Revelation. I also think Blood Artist is in here. Oh, Fellow Degree Familiar. Get it. Very cute. Little Fox. Pirate's Cutlass. Benevolent Blessing. Burning Anger. Some uncommons here. Guilt Leaf. Win Winover? Winover? Ooh, Plague Reaver. Nice. Ben. Here. Ghost of Remis de Petro. Ooh, Kiddies. You know, from any control, just common damage for just that much to each other opponent. Double strikey boy. Oh, a monarch token. Let's go. So two bunch of comes. Oh, sorry, I gotta sword this. It's not very good per first pack, I don't think. Um not very great. But okay, sorry. So I do this. I put the tokens over here. Cool. All right, next pack. I don't know if anybody else has this, but whenever you open a booster pack or a booster box. Do you like to keep the, the packs or like the uh, 
the um like the packs on each like uh row or column uh do you like to keep them even like i do it with gum as well i don't know i'm just kind of a like, weird and like a weird person when it comes to things like this i like keeping them even on, on the uh the whole columns so i don't know i'm just weird sisei's ring eh, kind of bad it's cool they reprinted it though see how he missed or secret stone so, uh, psh. Kraken, Ralgroth, oil, nice. Oil common, put that down here. I think you get a foil in every pack. I don't know why I'm excited about a foil. Okay. Why am I excited for a foil? I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know. Like, imagine if I pull like something really good out of this packs. I think I think the the number one card right now is Jewel Lotus out of this this specific set. I think it's uh, Jewel Lotus, um, Empiric Tutor, no Mana Drain. Nice. Ooh, Kamal. Nice. Yeah, sorry, I don't know. I don't know what to talk about when I'm opening these packs. You know, I don't. Some some of these packs are just gonna be really bad. I kind of know that. Um, I, I don't know why this is. I just I just really like this set. I just really like it. It's cheap right now. First mythic, by the way. Oh, two mythics actually. I really forgot that I got two mythics out of that. Cool. I took up two of the mythic slots out of this box. I don't even know if there, I don't know if there's like a limit to how many mythics you can pull. I, I assume there is. Like probably like ten, or like eight. You would think there is. For sure. There's like a I think I don't know if you can get Jessica's will out of the packs. But I know it's going for like thirteen, fourteen dollars right now. That's not a bad price. Oh, don't have a land. Okay. Turn to dust. Strengthen the pack. Or to razor. Heck yeah. Getting no fat pools yet. No fat pools. Very sad. We can't doubt ourselves too early though, right? We're we're gonna pull some epic stuff out of here. Wanna get good stuff. Good stuff we will get. I think there is 36 boosters in here. I can check actually. They got the box right here. What does it say? 24. Um Yeah. 24 packs of 20 cards. Wow. Such a good card right here. Definitely not, not good. Evolving Wilds is so much better. Psh, knock that out. Anyways, um, let's see. Common Pile. Boom. Target opponent gains control of target creature. Wrong turn. Nostril.
Dude, the thing about opening packs, I just go through them. I just zoom through them, you know. Uh, like I'll be like, my twenty fourth pack already, and I'll be like, man, I can't believe it's already done. You know, that's the worst thing about opening. Like, like opening the last pack is always the worst feeling, in my opinion. Like, man, I wish I had more. You know? You might not know. Some people might think it's a good feeling. I don't know. I don't know. I definitely do not. Boom. I want to add some music to this because I know this is probably like really quiet whenever I'm just not talking. And ain't nobody want to listen to silence, you know? All right, let's see. We're going to pull a jeweled lotus out of this pack right here. Maybe foil a jeweled lotus. Um, maybe the best, the best pack I've ever opened in my entire magic history. My entire magic history right here. Kind of just pull a jeweled lotus. War room. Dargo. I would agree familiar. And Prismatic Piper. The worst card. Not really. It's not like I've, I mean I've seen troll decks with it. It is kind of bad, to be honest. Like you can partner and you can have like any color you want. So that's uh the only good thing about it. Uh, I hope you guys are excited for Double Masters 2022. I am very excited. Today is there's five days until it comes out or is released and is shipped. I don't know if anybody pre-ordered it, but I pre-ordered one box because I saw some of the crazy stuff you can get from those boxes. And yeah, I want some of the crazy stuff. Some of that stuff is absolutely insane. Like, I can't believe they reprinted some of those cards. Like Phyrexian, or was it Phyrexian Arena? Or no, Phyrexian Altar? The one where you tap, where you sack and add uh, at mana of a color. A color. Um, best card in Magic. The best sack outlet in Magic, in my opinion. Just, it's just so good. Like, you can't really beat it. It's like, especially. I think. I think uh, Pitiless Plunder is also very good. Arcane Signet. Always good. Ooh, Scroll Rack. Let's go. Nice little Scroll Rack. Not a bad little pool there. Nevin Roll and Portent. Go ahead and get a sleeve for that bad boy. Psh. Oh no, damage. Dragon Shield. I don't know if Scroll Axe is actually expensive, but it's good anyways, so. Scroll Axe is a very good card. Um, I mean, in my opinion, I mean, I do, I'd say yeah, in my opinion, but I feel like a lot of people also have the same opinion that Scroll Axe is a good card. If you don't, you're been, you, you're wrong, you know? You're allowed to have the opposite opinion, but it's likely wrong, you know? But can an opinion really be wrong? I, mean, I don't know. Can anything anybody says really be wrong? I mean, yes. Yeah, probably. Very much. Very much so. What am I even saying right now? You know? Nobody even knows what's going on in this video. I pulled a scroll rack. That's it. Something that's going on right now. Pull a scroll rack. Maybe we're gonna pull a vampiric tutor or jeweled lotus out of this pack right here. Sure hope I do. You know, like this is gonna be a good, good time right here. It'll be a very good time. Gonna pull a jeweled lotus. I'll keep saying it until it happens. If it doesn't happen, then I'm a liar. You know. And uh, 
I keep saying you know, but serious question, you know. And that's one of my one of my redeeming qualities is I say you know a lot, and uh, a lot of people will realize that. I also say and uh, a lot. I say a lot of things a lot, because I have a very small vocabulary, like a lot of people, but also unlike unlike a lot of people. You know, I've never really read the next, never really read a dictionary, dictionary, dictionary. Wow, can't even pronounce words. But yeah, I say I say a lot of the same words over and over again. That's very, very annoying, and. A lot of people hate me for it. But you know who cares? I live my life and I say the same words a lot. So it doesn't really matter. Life is still good either way. We got a, I don't know, I can't pronounce that word, so I'm never going to say it, but something will. Sesets will. Sesets. Zits. I don't know. Tell me, tell me we're not only gonna pull scroll rack from this. We only pull scroll rack, I'm gonna cry. You know? It's gonna suck if I don't pull scroll rack. I don't know how many commons there is that are worth a whole lot on here. Commander Sphere is pretty good. It's kind of overrated. I feel like it's over, like ran a lot. Like, I feel like it's definitely ran too much. Ooh, Bell Borka. Kanji. Blasphemous Act. Some Blasphemous Act is probably what the best best red board wipe. I don't know. I think a lot of people use that one. You can cast it for one. One red. Cast it. Cast a blasphemous act for one red. Well, literally, that is it's kind of broken. A shock is one red, or and a lightning bolt. Isn't that crazy? You can kill the entire board for one red, but yet. The lightning bolt costs one red as well. You know, what am I even talking about anymore? Three visits. Great card. Better than Kodama's Reach ever will be. Uh, I mean, Cultivate. Kodama's Reach, whatever you want to call it. Same, same card, right? Just another reprint of Rampant Growth. Three visits, or three visits was before Rampant Growth. So Rampant Growth, wait, maybe? Maybe the same time. I don't know. I don't remember. It's been too long. Who knows? I don't know. I don't know. That's one thing I know. Boom. Boom. Okay. Elf Druid. Heck yeah. And comments. This is so far um not great. For one of for one of my best set, one of my favorite sets, it's not showing up showing up very well. I got a scroll rack. Not a bad card. I think I already have one though. Maybe. Um, Pentorn elves. Just another Leal on where else? Old breacher banned. Useless. This, this this was like a bunch of months ago that would have been a good pool now it's like man that card sucks i have like seven hole breachers that just just got thrown in the bulk bin and it's kind of sad so that card is just broken it should have never been printed you know so I'm glad it got banned, but then again, like all the people that spent all their money on hole breachers. Like, 
Kind of feels bad. But not really, because you ran Hole Breacher. And that card is stupidly OP. We got three. Seven packs left. We got like a total value of like 10 cents. So chilling. Wasn't a waste of money at all. Promise. Um, I will always just open Commander Legends. TCG player has them for like a buck 14, like 114. Uh, pretty good training center. Um, that might be worth something. Not really sure. I know those type of lands are usually worth something. I'll sleeve it up just just for the heck of it because I think it's good myself and I'll probably sleeve it up and put in another deck I put in a veteran deck um, something like that Staff of Domination. Let's go. It's not bad. Don't mind that. If, if you don't know about Staff of Domination, that is a combo piece and a half. Uh, probably, probably one of the best artifacts in Magic. I didn't say that. Nope, didn't say that at all. I'm going to have so many of these common and uncommon cards. Like, I've opened two boxes already of this. So I'm going to have like all of these commons plus more um so yeah that's gonna be fun gonna be great the thing about booster boxes you're not guaranteed anything and to expect to be guaranteed anything is just not a good choice just go in expecting nothing and come out happy but not me I was going expecting to get like, you know, Jeweled Lotus, something OP. Jeweled Lotus is very good. I don't even know if it's illegal anymore. They might have banned it. I haven't played Commander in forever. Open this pack upside down. That's the least. The least Navida. Oh. The least. Okay. Let's see. Boom. 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 Shiny. What if what if we called what if we called foil foil magic cards? What if we called them shinies? How Pokemon like in the actual Pokemon games call them shinies. Wouldn't that be good? Wouldn't that be funny? I think that'd be funny. I'm gonna start calling them shinies. Why? Because I can, and nobody can stop me. That's what I do. Empire Noble. I have so many of those horror tokens, by the way. Like, I have an absurd amount of those horror tokens. Like, too many to count. Almost. Alright, two packs left. Give me some magic. If you smack them together, it instantly puts a jeweled lotus or a vampiric tutor or a mana drain in there. Always. Always does. It's a new tactic people use. Ruminating Springs. Well, I think that one might also be worth money. I don't know. I'll put it. I'll put it in a sleeve. Cool. Another bounce. 
type of bounce land, kind of like a soaring. Not bad. Yeah, let's leave the Simic one up. It might be worth something. I already have the... The red, white one, what's it called? Don't tell me, don't tell me. Um... I don't know. Can't remember. See one of my favorite car crew. Rark, the thumbless. Jessica's will. Heck yeah. Sorry, I just had to skip all the way to the back. Just why not? Last pack. We've got Krark and Jessica's will. Can you imagine casting them together? You know, boom. Cast Krark. Have Krark on the battlefield. Cast Jessica's will. Got a foil last year command. Overall, this was a pretty bad, pretty bad booster box. I'm kind of being, to be serious. Uh, Jessica's will is definitely worth something though. I think it's like fifteen dollars now. Um, if if you don't run this card in any red deck, you should. It's good for three mana. If you have your commander out, you can get like seven red mana plus three free cards to cast or play um yeah just leave it around this is what we got we're racking two of these lands i don't know if the lands are actually worth anything but should be i think i should also sleep with the staff of domination because i also think a staff of domination is worth as worthy of a sleeve yeah so i mean whole breacher too it's not terrible but it got banned, so. Uh, yeah, Jessica's Will is definitely the best out of the Wills, in my opinion. Elgith. Heck yeah. Let's leave up Staff of Domination. I think I already have a couple, but let's leave it up. That's all we got. Right here, scroll rack is probably the best pull. I think it's probably like a couple bucks. I'll go check actually. Be right back. I'm seeing like anywhere from like 15 to 20 bucks on scroll rack. Um, probably go check the other cards as well. I'm seeing like five bucks on the staff. Um, like 10 bucks on Jessica's will and like, uh, let's see seven bucks on both the training center and uh rejuvenate springs so 20 25 32 39 40 uh 49 i don't i don't really know what the other cards that are of value but i, I probably have at least over 100 here maybe maybe not i don't know um Anyways, thank you guys for watching this video. I'll see you guys in the next video. And, uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, maybe if you guys want to see me open Double Masters 2022, give me, like, two likes on the video. Appreciate it. Would appreciate it. Would be great. Would very much enjoy that. Because I want to open the Double Masters 2020 box. 22 box. I already bought one. I already pre-ordered it. It should be on its way in five days. Would be great. Anyways, peace.